Hello, boys and girls. My name is Otsusti, and welcome back to episode eight of uh, Game Dev Tycoon. That's the name of the game. Last time we moved into the big office. Uh, that's the last move we can do. We can still expand this office, and. Um, the next logical goal would be uh, creating large computer games. But for that, uh, in order to do it uh, reasonably, we need one more developer. So let's see what we can do in today's episode. But first, I think um, new game is in order. Um, do we have a cool topic that we have not yet done? Um, I think crime we missed out. Crime that's uh, action and uh, let's be creative and name it my GTA. Uh, and of course, it's a medium game. Uh, action. Yeah, let's take the top three systems with our newest game engine. Um, 3D graphics. Ooh, and the reuse for the last game we did. Oh, it looks pretty good. Okay, uh, looks like we did something right there. Um, and that opens up new training opportunities. Uh, we also need to uh, to skill up to uh, get better at uh, creating games and also uh, to improve the, the game a bit further. Um, we can do a, a research department uh, once uh, we get uh, to a certain point in uh, in one of the skills of our employees, I think uh, it's 700. I guess. Um, uh, story seems a bit. I think story is more important uh, for action games. Okay, they all get a bit tired, but we should be able to manage this. So let's see what the uh, convention can do for us. Almost half a million, that's great. And we are doing good with that game. Um, now uh, let's let's hold off for a bit until we are in the second phase, starting our man uh, marketing campaign. Um, Yeah, and then do the marketing. We have quite a bit of hype there, and that should rise until a certain point. And I think if we uh, time it rightly, if we can release it at uh, at uh, at the peak. Ooh, we have, uh, okay, so now we can do large games 
without using a publisher. I will skip that point. Or, yep. But we still need an uh, additional uh, developer in order to do that efficiently and also create large games that are, that are actually um, well received. Because if you don't have the, the standard uh, in the uh, design and technology uh, department, well, basically every decision you did right, um, just that lack uh, uh, could cost you a good game. Um, yeah, open world here. And let's push this one through. And then to finish off, of course, we need to uh, fix any bugs that are in there. Well, this is probably not our best game, but let's release it anyway. I don't think with our tired crew we can manage anything more. So let's send them all on uh, vacation. They earned it. So now not a great game, which is probably due to uh, uh, our developers not being uh, well rested. But let's find out what we did right for the last two games. Um, Training. Um, we can do specialization, and for the specialist training, we need 700 in design or technology. So, let's try. This one, this seems to be uh, uh, technology orientated. Okay. It was the, the high flyer. And then let's do the report for the uh, other game as well. Um, And so everything has to uh, do something. So we get battle. And then I think we will do a, a sequel. Okay, action and crime, good combination, uh, story quest not that important, and box action great, crime everyone, okay. Right, so once everything is done with their task,
we can do another game and let's make it a sequel. Um, Sports simulation. Yep, that's certainly a great one. Um, let's make it Summer Olympics 2000 and we will pick the same three platforms. Of course, our newest game engine, and uh, it's let's do another 3D graphic. And already the, the first box are in. Um, Okay, uh, let's go with the linear story here. We're working hard on it. Let's do once again a medium boost. And then after this one, we probably should uh, do some more research. do we have? Can we crack the half million mark? Uh, not entirely, but close. But it helps certainly with the uh, with the hype. And um, uh, we definitely need some marketing here. Once all our uh, bugs are uh, resolved, which are quite a few. And as they are still fresh, they also contribute to uh, other things than uh, box only. That looks like a good thing, right? And uh, salary increase for several people. And new research topics. Okay, what does the review says? A 10. And a 10. I would guess another 10 and a 9. Yeah. Then let's do some uh, some research um i'm not that fast about multi uh genre, but uh, multi-platform optimized might be uh, good um 
and also mod support and maybe a new topic that uses uh, all our uh, research points then we will do uh, the game review here and after one month we're already at number one and have sold already 1.5 million great so we had two games uh, that are or of the last three games we had two that were quite successful um, so uh, we can actually think about uh, hiring an additional developer we went up from uh, 20 something to uh, uh, over uh, 50 million so I think we are on the right track so let's do another um, game we research a new topic racing and that's uh, Grand Prix and it's a simulation game and what do you know it's the same uh, triplet of um, platforms yeah it's a medium and yeah then yeah, let's deal with this first. And probably want another uh, one that's good with design. We did not spend too much money on the on the research there. So that's we only uh, uh, get two, but I think we can go with uh, uh, with Kristen here. Uh, train her in staff welcoming, so she feels uh, better integrated. Let's try switching this around a bit. Um, we probably also should do some marketing. That's advised. Um, small booths, 
hopefully we can crack the half million mark this time. Okay, strategy games seem to be popular at the moment. Okay. What does the survey says? Yes! And release the game right after the conference. Right, then the old crew can go on vacation. Ooh, bad reviews. That's probably because they were tired. Because I would imagine that racing and simulation would be at least an okay uh, combination. Um, So, before we can create our next game engine, we probably should invest a bit more into uh, a graphic. can do better there as well. Okay. Does the game report said okay. It was a great combination. And racing is great for everyone. Right. So with everyone well rested, let's try to do our first large game. Um, before we name it, we probably should pick a topic. It's uh, transport and it's a simulation game. Um, big surprise there. Um, open TTD after one of my favorite games, which is open source. And Our newest game engine and it's a 2D game just to shake it up a bit yes and Seeing that this is a large game, which means uh, the development um, takes a bit longer, let's do a small campaign here and start it even uh, uh, early on. Oh, really? No way. And with these larger games, each development phase uh, uh, takes a bit longer. And um, you 
We also have to try to uh, balance out a bit here. it it's virtually impossible to get um, anywhere without overtaxing uh, our uh, employees here um, so and that's with with five additional developers um, so there would not be any chance to do that with only four so five is the bare minimum here uh, but I think if uh, all goes well um, we should be able uh, to uh, soon hire uh, the, the last slot here But let's see first how this game goes. And then also focus a bit on uh, research and uh, training. Um, let's go with a medium boost once again. Okay, the box are dealt with, so now a few more points here and there, maybe also one or the other box. Uh, yeah, as expected we have new high scores on both levels. As we spend quite a bit more time on it. And convention just coincides with our game release and once more more visitors. Um, so we need a bit more training here. How did we do? It's a seven and a six and a seven and a six. So not great, but that's probably um, due to uh, our uh, constraints. Um, uh, with the uh, uh, with the lack of uh, capacity uh, for for our game for our development, um, well, let's invest 100 research points here. Um, generate game report go on location and do a bit of training here we are not doing too bad Man, we even sold half a million copies. OK, 
Okay, location, location, location. And location. And this should mean they are well rested once Ralph is uh, back. And with that, I will end this episode and soon we will be uh, able to do another game engine and make even better games. But for today, that's all. See you later. Goodbye.